It's the start of a new week, and the world is still at war, both in the Middle East and in Europe. It's Monday, October 16th. Welcome to the President's Daily Brief. I'm Mike Baker, your eyes and ears on the world stage. Let's get briefed. It's been over a week now since the Hamas terrorists' rampage across southern Israel, and the IDF continues preparing for its anticipated main offensive into the Gaza Strip. We'll examine the situation in Gaza and discuss the challenges of evacuating civilians from an area soon to become a war zone. A little later in the program, China is speaking out on the escalating situation, criticizing Israel's response to Hamas's invasion as, quote, extending beyond self-defense. That, of course, coming from the CCP, which has made a practice of exterminating its Uyghur population. So perhaps moralizing by Xi's regime isn't really noteworthy. Meanwhile, as experts forecast at least a million Gaza refugees, progressives, including Representative Jamal Bowman, push for the U.S. to offer sanctuary. You may remember Democrat Representative Bowman. He's the fellow in Congress who, just the other week, couldn't tell the difference between a fire alarm and a push-to-open button. So the complexities of the Israeli-Palestinian conflict might just be beyond him. And wrapping up with our back-of-the-brief segment, we revisit a pair of investigations that we're keeping an eye on. 